I'm Ed Rosberg. I'm CEO and one of the co-founders at Groby Optimization. MIP is a very powerful technology. Um, it's got a very strong mathematical foundation. So the roots of mixed integer programming go back to the 1940s. Technology's been refined and improved over the last 50 plus years. And technology is now to a point where it can robustly solve just a huge variety of problems for many different industries. MIP has literally transformed many industries, including supply chain planning, electrical power generation and distribution, uh, computational finance, uh, sports scheduling. The list of industries that have been affected by MIP is just incredibly long. One unique property of mixed integer programming is its combination of expressiveness and robustness. Um, what this allows you to do, it allows you to state a problem, obtain high quality, reliable solutions to that problem, and then later you can make a change to the problem as your business needs change. And MIP will continue to produce high quality, reliable solutions. Um, this is actually quite different from most technologies where if you make a change to the problem you're solving, you very often need to totally rethink your approach to solving that problem. So the breadth of applications of mixed integer programming, is, it's quite enormous. So at one point we actually did a tally of all the different industries that our customers are in, and we got to nearly 40 different industries. MIP should really be a part of any company's analytics toolbox. Uh, MIP actually complements other analytics techniques like machine learning quite nicely. Uh, we're seeing more and more companies building applications that combine machine learning and optimization. Typically what they do is they use machine learning to make predictions about what's like likely to happen in their business in the future. And then they use optimization to use those decisions to make recommendations about what actions to take in order to take advantage of those likely future outcomes.